Okay, we're out here at I-70 in Gage where a non-injury accident has just been reported. We originally heard there might have been injuries in this crash. It occurred around 5.38 a.m. in the westbound lanes of I-70 just east of the southwest Gage exit. But as you can see, the scene is just now being cleared. Police are moving off the road here. There were um, other officers on scene and the lane was blocked there momentarily. But officers are just now leaving the scene. Saw one vehicle go off, drive off, so the vehicle that wasn't uh, disabled by any means. And then uh, we did hear that there might have been a hit and run involved. We believe that the other uh, car might be down by 10th and Gage. So we're going to uh, cut this interview, uh, this report short here. We're going to head over to 10th and Gage to see if we might be able to find where the other individual might be. But at this point, no injuries at all, apparently. And uh, the scene is now cleared. I-70 westbound here. It was never really closed. Uh, there was some traffic restriction, one lane going west. But there wasn't much traffic this time of day to begin with. So again, now you see traffic flowing smoothly both lanes, I-70 west between McVicker and Gage. And again, we are on the off-ramp from westbound I-70 right here at the Gage Boulevard exit. We'll keep you up to date on this story if we can track down some information. We will come back live on Facebook. Otherwise, check cjonline.com later for more information. Reporting from West Topeka, I-70 Gage, this is Phil Anderson for cjonline.com.